There's finally some good news coming out of the Gulf of Mexico. Engineers have succeeded in hooking up a long tube to the blown out well on the seabed. And the tube is now funneling some of the leaking crude oil to a tanker above. It's working as planned and we're very slowly uh, in, uh, increasing the rate that's coming from the, the riser tool up to the surface. So we do have oil and gas coming to the ship now. BP says it's too early to measure how much crude is being collected. But it says crews will ramp up the amount of oil it collects over the next few days. It also admits the tube is no panacea for the blown out well. It's a positive mood, but, uh, uh, move, but let's keep in, in context. We're about shutting off the flow of oil from this well. The final chance to do that could come in a week. Engineers plan to shoot heavy mud into the crippled blowout preventer on top of the well and then permanently entomb the leak in concrete. It's not clear, however, that option will be successful. Meanwhile, top officials in the Obama administration say they're closely monitoring the situation. In a joint statement, Secretary of Homeland Security Janet Napolitano and Secretary of the Interior Ken Salazar said, we will not rest until BP permanently seals the wellhead, the spill is cleaned up, and the communities and natural resources of the Gulf Coast are restored and made whole. Carlotta Bradley, The Associated Press.